Jade Goody. Since leaving the Big Brother house, Britain's most successful reality TV star has had a full-on three years. There's been boyfriends, babies, and breakups. And all the while, she's appeared just about everywhere and said just about everything. You paint the Mona Lisa. Pistachio. <laughs> She might not be famous for her brains. I admit to being sick. Or good looks. Attractive. <laughs> but Jade's about to combine both and set up a beauty salon. She's got her builders hard at it. Oh my God, Carly, look what I've done. She's found her staff. Where's my own boss? I can't even be my own boss. She's named her salon. Ugly. And best mate Carly's going to manage it. I'm thinking, what do we do next? Because I haven't got a clue. But they have got the qualifications, the cash, and a lot to get their heads around. Uh, listen, I'm very interested. But soon after they're finished, I'm just like, <laughs> what was that about again? And whatever happens, we follow Jade's every move. <laughs> and after all the laughs, <laughs>, <laughs> the tears. Oh, it would be nice to act like a 23 year old sometime. I can't cope with things that are on top of me. The tantrums. Shut up! For fuck's sake, why can't you just. Oh. Silent air And the tips. Ryan! Get off. Get off. <laughs> Serious. Enough! We're supposed to be as a team. Carly and her miserable fucking face all the time it annoys me, to be honest. Will Jade's salon finally open its doors without a hitch? It will. Don't Why are you getting stressed about this for? What I'm trying to say to you and get across to you is it is a problem. My problem with the floor right done, your problem with the wallpaper here. So fucking what is problem? It's a problem. The wallpaper's not here. The floor's not finished. I haven't had enough sleep. I'm supposed to be going on a holiday. Anything else? He's <laughs> double looking at me, please. I guess that's a no then. Here till quarter to one in the morning painting this room. So I'm just doing the second coat to get it finished. Three days until the sun opens. I'm really worried. We're not, I like to we'll be, nothing's going to be ready for Monday, no way. The floor's not completely finished. We're struggling to get someone to do that. Wallpaper, um, still waiting for it to arrive. How are you doing? You don't look very happy. No, I feel up, and against, up against it a bit at the minute. Um, our wallpaper's not here. The floor's not finished, and I don't know who's doing the floor, because it wasn't down to us, but I feel like we're going to end up doing it. So that's stressing me out a little bit. I haven't had enough sleep. I'm supposed to be going on a holiday. Anything else? Do you think they'll open by window? Um, well, they've got to finish the floor off, because we're not going to go off the floor. I can't expect Jason to leave the wooden floor now, so the job's half finished there, so we'll get our bits done. Who's finishing the wooden floor? What? Who's going to be finishing the wooden floor through there? Builders going to have to do it. Well, they can't because they're not contracting to do that. I thought you said you were going to get it done. Yeah, I know, but I've asked my boyfriend his dad, but his dad's now got shingles and... But that's not the builder's fault. Yeah, I know, you can't watch. I've got to get the other pages in place and how to do it. So that means that the floor and dashboard will cost more than 3000 said originally? No, it won't. It's cost 1500 so far. All right, OK. OK. Thank you. Don't worry, you can freeze. Don't worry. We've got all done. Sam, got to get someone to finish that floor. Well, don't worry, the boys will see it. Hello. Hello, Don. Alright. This is Faith. We've got our rest of the day. See my work lads last night. I was in here till quarter past twelve painting last night. I've actually got paint in my hair, paint around, paint on my feet. We're actually haven't even had a wash yet because I've been out since the crack of dawn worrying about. Hello, Karen. You have got more marks on the ceiling. No, I'm going to go. Carly! I'm going over and quite paint up, aren't I? Yeah, I hope you do. I hope it's not on the skirting boards neither. But, well done. You're really going to get your sun by, Jay, not Monday. Move this to me, because I'm going to go for the Ben's dad's moving in the yield. Is he? Mm. Oh, God. That's why he wasn't here at the party.
to be honest, our stuff, there's not a lot left to do. The wallpaper's a bit of a worry because it's got to come from America. There's no one here yet. <coughs> Derry? Derry? Well, Derry? Oh. The wallpaper's not here. I've just been chasing it up to where it is. It's got a bank collar with the lathe and all of it. So, so what does that mean? Well, there's probably a courier somewhere, we're just chasing where it is, it's also our goal. I'm a bit worried now. Well, I'm not. Well, I am. I'm surprised. You're, you're probably not, because you've not got to open your doors on Monday with half wallpaper off and half wallpaper not. Will it be here? I've, I've, kind of, I've made a phone call now. I didn't know until this morning. It wasn't here. And the mirrors? Where are the mirrors? When are the mirrors going to arrive here? Do you know when they come in? Saturday, like it was already, already arranged. We couldn't do the mirrors until the worktops were on, Jade. Because they're specially cut. The worktops have been on for a week now, that, though. No, I haven't. Both have to be cut in, OK? And the back bit's been put on, right? Why are you getting stressed about this for? Because we open on, we open on Monday. There's no wallpaper on any walls. There's wallpaper not even arrived to those walls in here. There's no skirting around the actual bit of the well, skirting wall. Well, it's not about this problem, because I could be saying, well, it's your problem that the wallpaper is, it's your problem that the mirror's on it, and it's your problem that the other wallpaper is, but I'm not saying it's your problem. I'm just saying that it is a problem. But unfortunately, it's going to be here on time. It is a problem. It's not a problem. How is it a problem? It is a problem. How is it a problem? Well, how is it not a problem? There's nothing here, Derry. There's nothing here at all. Where's the wallpaper? You said the wallpaper was there yesterday. Not, not, not your mistake, their mistake for sending less of however much it was. You said that the Chardet paper, whatever it's fucking called, was there yesterday and it's still not here. So I it is a problem. It was Look, here your yes. problem, my problem, it is a problem. It was here yesterday. Well, being told and it being here is two different things. So what I'm trying to say to you and get across to you is it is a problem. My problem in the floor right done, your problem in the wallpaper here. So fucking what is problem? It's a problem. This is our chandelier, but obviously we've not got no gold, so we're painting this like a green, it sounds sick, but it's like a proper green effect thing. This chandelier is gorgeous, isn't it, Carl? Yeah. Happy with that? I broke my arm. Oh! I'm just with a paintbrush. I just should have spray it on, maybe. Oh! Oops! Is that right? This is like green, green. I've done this. <laughs> the top's too green. You don't try to get this off. I fuck the top, you know, it looks crap. Oh. Carly, I ruined the top of the chandelier a bit, but that's when I didn't know how to do it. It was meant to be gold green. I was like painting it on. I don't know, just don't look at me like that, because I already feel shit. I'm doing my head in. Go on, do you want me to put the shit on? Sure, is that mine? No. I'm patient, money. It's got to be Antigo. Oh. <laughs> Van Tingo. Oh, third degree. <laughs> it's got to be that effect, and I'm not doing very well. Right, okay. Maybe we should get sandpaper and sandpaper. I don't know. Oh, yeah. uh, we've got Audrey Hepburn stencils. <laughs> so we're drawing Audrey on the wall. Apparently, I look a bit like Audrey. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> This is really dark. Sugar lumps. I like mine when mine was lighter. Nice oh, yours is nice. That's how mine was lighter. Yeah, I think yours looks better. I hate fucking ladders. Oh, Jesus. Ooh. I was so groomed when I first started the show. I'm now a pile of dirt. My image of a businesswoman, what certainly wasn't up a foot of ladders. In a pair of jeans, with no drawers on, I had, because I jumped out of bed this morning, I had a quick wet whitewash, which is sick. Oh. <laughs> Paint on my feet. My image is, is a swimming glasses, and you're still walking with your little black folder. How's it going, builders? Set them up the ladder like that. Paint laundry on the wall. 
Bikini lady, mad bikini woman. <laughs> it's actually quite gross, to be honest. When we went last time, she wasn't really keen on us, was she, Carl? No. She turned out late. But then she did warm to us in the end. Oh, yeah, she was nice in the end, but we were like two hours late. We didn't speak to each other the whole way home, we were social. <laughs> Carly's literally seen the whole inside of me, I see the whole inside of Carly, and plus three other women. It was disgusting. Minutes to get there. We're we going to be late. Like, she'll, <laughs> she'll probably refuse to do it. <laughs> Keep your finger on it. Yeah, it is. Thanks. Oh. You're not opening it. Oh, no, it's that right. What? You're not opening it. Originated from Egypt, from the Middle East, uh, particular Egypt, because as you know, that Cleopatra in the history, she liked always to have hair free, even all her body, including that area. And the bum in it, you do the bum. And the bum down, everywhere. Yeah. For two reasons hygiene and sex. So it stimulates it, doesn't it? Well, it's, it's a nice feeling. Yes. Even all my clients, really, they love it. Now, they cannot stand to have any hair down yeah. below at all. You know, the worst time for them, it's in between. Yeah, because it gets yeah, prickly. Yeah. <gasps> the itching. You know, not the itching, there's not shaving. No, There's I know, no but, the, but you still, still, like, you still feel, yeah. feel weird. And you, you're like... It's like a hedgehog where you can sort of... Shh, shh. Jesus <laughs> Christ. I 
I probably need more hair because I'm not good. Who's got more hair? I have more hair. Oh, God. Don't bruise me. <laughs> Now, where are you going? Which station you go? Which part are you going? At uh, the lips first. You're going to stretch it down. That's right. Pull up. Fantastic. I did it! <laughs> she did it! <laughs> that is good, because normally it doesn't go off like that on me. Carly, you've got a lot to live up to this time around. <laughs> Up. That's good. Thank you. All right. Yes. Yay! I don't like the idea of me putting my hands near my face. That's right. It's a very nice job. I'm glad you changed your opinion of me. Is it finished? Yes. I expect it. No, Good she handled, she handled this, this time is, is really nicely. She handled it very nicely. I'm proud of you, Jet. Thank you. It's nice. Ooh. Very nice. <laughs> We're done. <laughs> it was good. It was mm. good. But I think it's worse when you have to, like, pull the yeah. lips, because you literally have your hands inside the... When you're the trying to stretch. Like, yeah. Things, when you're doing the top, you have to touch the actual little man in the boat mm. thing. Ooh. Really, really good today. I really, to be honest, I actually enjoyed yeah. it. I really did enjoy it. We knew it. a little bit what to expect, didn't we? So yeah, well, last time it was a bit funny and deep, and we didn't know. Um, whereas this time we know, she's really cute, isn't she, really? Yeah. Oh, sick girl. She had a bit of pubes with an eyelash. Got to have, it's a day before my shop opens. We've got the staff, but just to make sure they're up to speed, we're going back to where I did my boot calls. Just for some refresher training. Can I ask you to speed work? First up, Kiara. She's dead pretty, happy and bubbly. <laughs> what you want to see when you walk in the shop? Good afternoon, Jade Salon. How can I help? Perfect for a receptionist. You've got the job. Congratulations, Kerr. Claire looks good to me. She was like a white grafter. She's brilliant at waxing. It's all right. Nice girl, Claire. Oh, I really messed it up. Kevin, I feel sorry for him. I think he needs a chance. He's not got no confidence at all. Right, do you know what? If you do make a mistake, I don't tell you client then, so you just need to just keep it in. Right. And he ain't the best, right. but I'm sure we can make him a bit better. Yeah. We're really, really happy with your work. Really good at what you do. I like Kaylee. She's a little nail expert. Me and Carly ain't too good at nails. So, yeah, she'll be great. I was really sort of eager to sort of work in a cell, and I have been for a long time, especially for Jade. Gemma's trained in makeup. But she does do other treatments as well. She's a really sweet girl. I'm sure clients will take to her. Then there's the twins. I love the twins. They're so shy. They're going to be our Saturday girls. They're training at college at the minute. Me and Carly are going to help them out as well when they come into the salon. So that's my staff. Oh, my God. I can't believe I've got my own staff. <laughs> Grouting. Do you know how to do it? No. I said that to you because I just want to help. I don't think I'm useless. I don't really know what they think I do. Jack of all trades, me. Eh? Coming together slowly, isn't it? Just giving it a second coat. It usually has to have two coats. Jade was kind enough to put the first coat on for me. Now, in truth, she made a real pig's ear of it. She just proper divvied it and just dropped her things and got up and went to do the next job and left it. Yeah. It's twenty to twelve. But we knew it was going to be like this, didn't we? The 
done. Look what we're putting in now, boys. You little watery feeters. <laughs> it's our little present from the girl who's got one for each room. They're lovely. They are. Turn it off, you get the full effect. Where's the water? No, no water comes out of them, Jace. Yeah, you have to fill them up with water and it's... Oh, uh, do you? Yes, yeah. Oh, they are a water feature. I didn't know that. Yeah. Where? I mean, you just get some water, not too much. And then you turn it on. Right down. A bit more. We're blow up, there's batteries in there. Jace, I think you... Jace, we're yeah, going to blow up, there's batteries, due so. Did you turn it on? Yeah, it's on, that's where the lights are going from. Oh, right. Curly, Curly! Whoa, it does come out! What's the water going to be like? You just keep cycling around. But I'm the way it goes into the batteries. What do you reckon about water and batteries? Yeah, I bought them water features off the guy that brings the DVDs round, and it was supposed to be a joke, but it's a joke that's backfired on me, because they're actually using them. They just look so tacky. Still. See the radio eating right out. Mm -hmm. Carly, I fancy a drink. Do you? Yeah, I do, but we've only got that champagne and we want to have it at the end. Who says we've got to have it at the end? It goes up a bit pokey. Well, fuck me and let's have it now. Everyone! I think we should have it at the end because otherwise, let's just get everything done and then we can have a champagne and then go home. No, why do you want champagne to go home? Why would you want champagne and then work? I'll listen to you when it comes to Dermalogica and I'll listen to you when it comes to telling me what to do in the salon because I don't know. I'll listen to you when you tell me I'm spending too much money, but I will not listen to you when you tell me not to drink <laughs> alcohol. Sorry. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is just a little frankly from me and Carly. Sorry it's a mouthful, but that's what I was. It's 20, to 20 past 12 and you're all still here. Carly, thanks very much. Well, good luck anyway. Yeah. We're paying yeah. off your yeah. treatment. Yeah. Cheers. 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 <laughs> <laughs>
welcome to Uglies. I mean, do you remember it was? Look at it now. I think my salon is one of the nicest salons around here. It's got a lot of character. I've put a lot of money into it to give it the character that it's got. It's got antiques in it. It's got things that look antique but aren't really antique. The rooms are all really different. Yeah, I really, really like my salon. First day, feeling really, really tired. Got home at about quarter to three in the end. Um, but this morning I woke up, I woke up a little bit late actually, but then I got up. I was really excited and just couldn't wait to get here. I've already given the girls their first job. Kiara's was filling out the reception book and the other girls are pricing all the stock. Morning girls. Hi. You look very lovely. Mm -hmm. You alright? Yeah, you? I've got like butterflies, I feel really a bit nervous, but a bit like excited as well. So these are our price lists, what we're offering our salon. Nice, no. Is that only spot? What does it say? Sparking. It says sparking eyes. Oh no! Oh no! Typing. Oh, and another one. I've round Oh no! Yeah. <laughs> so it's must be Junior! 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 We've got spelling mistakes. Three circles with spelling mistakes and send it back. There's another one there. Oh, stop this! Yeah. I've got to go, I've got to go and send these back. So spelling mistakes, which is my fault, but I get it to if it was me, it would be exceptionally normal. But it's not normal for Kylie to do that because she actually can spell. Yeah, the font's really nice. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah, it does look really good, Jane. Yeah. Don't panic, don't panic. Doolux! Have a doolux <laughs> facial. All right, Kevin! We've <laughs> got the picture! <laughs> And then printed up. That's just cost me however much. <laughs> I thought now the shop was all done, I can start right taking care of myself again, buying shoes and bags. Obviously not. I've got to buy more treatment menus. Because <laughs> they say do loves painting them rather than do loves. Sparking eyes. <laughs> Spark me up. <laughs> The first few days actually were a bit of a worry. Not many clients come in. So me and Kylie decided to have an open day to try and get people through the door. A bit of canopies here and there, a bit of pims, a bit of orange juice, a bit of kids, and a bit of wine for me. <laughs> we have a chocolate block, fully booked. Oh, I've got no time for this. See you later. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Eyelash tint now. I said I'm not going to do them because I'm a mother, so let's throw it to the paper. Um, but she said it's all right, and no one else could do it because they're all from the book, so I've got to do it. We didn't take any cash on the first day, but we took cash on from the Tuesday onwards, and now we're taking more and more and more, which is really good. I love it. I love coming here in the morning. Love it. I'm naked. Should we quickly oh, down the pins? Yeah, I need to. Thanks, Jim. You can have one if you want. Do you have one? Yep, yeah, we'll do. I didn't mean like down it, down it, as in. I'm thirsty though. You'll be drunk. Not one. I'm drinking then because you've got a client. Just because she's your sister, it doesn't matter. I'm going to do a set of acrylics on Kylie's auntie now. Finally, in the own salon doing proper treatments. A bit mental. Yeah. People come in to pay me to make them look better. It's brilliant. A bit mad though. I'm loving it. 
Yeah, lovely. Just the right length. Won't get in the way. Lovely. That's it, you're done. This was Jade's first full day back to back appointments with no break, not even a lunch break. Yeah, it's just a bit weird. I haven't worked probably for three years. I'll go five over show, I'll do a bit of that, but I've not worked. It's killing me. Today I've done an eyelash tin and an eyelash perm. How'd that go? Oh, she loved it. She said, it's the first one I've had when I've not opened my you eyes and it's stung, didn't she, girls? Hmm? Yeah. She said, it was the first one I've had that I've not opened my eyes and it ain't, it's not stung me. I was like, she really? Nice natural curl. And can I just say, did you see her tan? I know, you're not. not. <laughs> 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 Sorry. Don't give me your dirty little evil lies, but I'm entitled to burp today. I've had no lunch, no you drinks. Fire. You've had breaks. I'll come out here and you'll be standing up there. What? Today I've done an eyelash tint and I have firm. I was really scared about it coming out. She was nice. A fake towel, a fake towel. We've done loads of manicures and pedicures. How many manicures? A lot, Karen. Oh! I'm a bastard of acrylic, you said I had all... Two sets? Oh, I don't know, and I hate you did every minute of it. Awful. I've got a full set on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. And just now that we're both Please. actually quite crap at you. This week's been well good. Like, I've got an eating today for loose women, which is really, really good to, you know, get. Um, I'm very nervous, I've got a screen test today to see if they want me on their show. And I'm fucking light. That's not a good start. I'm always a guest on people's show, but I've never actually presented. So for offers to start coming in now, for me presenting, is a big change and like, a big thing, really. It's the next step, and I'm looking forward to it, and I'd love to be able to do it, but I'm here late. Um, Probably gonna be crap. I ain't read any papers, so I don't know what's going on in the nose. It's a chat show about what goes on in the world, and I've not got a clue, to be honest. Right, coming out. Hi, girls. It's my mate, Han. It's her birthday today. It's mine tomorrow. Where's my balloons? They're not them out the back. Come in. Come okay, in. Come on, Han. Happy birthday, Happy girls. girls. I'm having a pink one. You have that one. I'm having a blue one. I like your dress. Oh, matches, yeah. So, what do you think of my daughter's shop? Beautiful. Yeah, she's gone all old Look, yeah. look at her chair. Yeah. It's like 90 years old. There you go. Thank you. What's your name? Kiara. Hi, Kiara. Hello, Thank you. Here you're coming in for a treatment next week. <gasps> yeah, because I wanted Hollywood. And Jade said, She's got to have the shop shut to do me Hollywood, she said, so I don't scream the place down. So, yeah, I'm coming in to have my Hollywood done. Yeah. Well, Jay doesn't know, but I'm going to have my full tattoo done on the following Wednesday. I'm having a butterfly, full tattoo on my fanny. So, and it's got 16 colours on it, and it is beautiful, but Jay does not know this, and she's not allowed to know this until I've finished it. And once I've had the Hollywood, then I can have my tattoo done because um, hair doesn't grow back off the tattoos. And then when I'm an old lady, I'll have pretty funny. <laughs> That's the reason why. <laughs> you asked. I told you. Hi, so basically, it's kind of your reaction to the story um, about uh, the affair. Um, do you think, um, you know, have you got any personal experiences of infidelity? Has anyone ever cheated on you? Have you ever cheated on anybody? What do you think, Jade? I've actually never cheated, but I've been cheated on. OK, great. And it just makes you lose, like, quite a bit of self-esteem and just think, what does that person have that I don't have? It makes you look at yourself a little bit more. Mm. Or you sort of, like, take the other role and you're just like, do you know what? Mm. If you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think, so I didn't have a word to say. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think Sienna should do? See, do think if it was me, I'd probably stay with Jude Lord because he's an absolute <laughs> goddess, so I would stay with him. I wouldn't care. He could probably have the nanny in bed next to us and I'd still lie there. Probably won't talk about age gap relationships. This is disgusting. I'll just, I'll just run through it with you. Really? I disagree.
brave and complete what she's doing. I think her daughter and her sons and her family need to just grab her away and maybe put her in an old people's home for a week because she's not allowed to be this 34-year-old man. It's not right. <laughs> And I can't actually believe what happens when it comes to wanting kids. No way. No, that. <laughs> you know, I just think nans out clubbing and stuff. I, again, that just ain't right to me. My, my mum's a nan and she's quite mental. I mean, I'm an old lady, I'm pretty funny. She does go out clubbing and that, but she's 40 something. It's not old, you know, she's not 60. She was 60 and I still clubbing. I said, put your eyes away now and go indoors. Mm. I hope they don't sleep together. <laughs> Probably offended half of Granny Britain's grannies out there. <laughs> <laughs> right, thank you very much. No, thank you, Jade. Lovely thank to meet you. you. And Joe, thanks very much. Thanks, Jade. Thank you. Thank you. Right, bye, thank you. Come on. Right, let's go. You can take the wine with you. It's beautiful. Well done, girls. It's very, very lovely. Jade, it is gorgeous. Right, is this is where I have my yeah, toes done. Yeah, you can sit there. Ha, ha, I'm going around here making your feet done now. And Paul Carlin's got to deal with it. This is a birthday present for me, Mum. Nice to be able to look after her. I hope she likes the shop. I hope she's proud of me. I've got eyelashes. Very, very lovely salon. Very, very proud of you, Jade. Cheers. A bit disappointing, didn't get loose women. Obviously not good enough, but never mind. They're not like mine. We've shut the salon today. We're having a makeup training day, but we're just waiting for Jade to arrive because she's a little bit late. And it's now 20 past 11. <laughs> but I was like, <laughs> with my clothes on last night. Shit. Got my keys. Hello. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Hi, girls. I'm so sorry I'm late. Um, I can't stay long because I've parked my car. We're in the corner. <laughs> Part there. What do you mean you can't stay long? Well, my car's part and Congo. In some bay. Right. It says 30 minutes maximum. <laughs> Where is your uniform? At home. <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to a teacher. At home. This, um. Do you know what time it is? Three o'clock? Yes, hon. She's been here since half ten. Yes, I just don't, I'm being horrible. I'm not interested in my job. Alright, we got the staff. We got the salon. She's but coming to teach us. Twenty past eleven. You said you'd be here soon. Yeah, but I hadn't been lunch. Turned up what we bought yesterday. Yeah, why did you tell me what I bought yesterday? I might have thought it was clean and I put it off first thing. I don't mean it all fault. The lady's a lovely lady for yes, coming down here. It, it, it gives a bad impression on them. They'll think they can bowl in. Well, no, they don't, because we don't pay them to bowl in. Like, I don't get paid to work here. What about me? I've been here since quarter to nine this morning. Yeah, but that's because <laughs> you choose to. <laughs> But I am sorry that I'm late in that it's all, you know, it's probably unfair on you, but Carly, you know that I was not gonna be committed. <laughs> I am committed to an extent, and you know, this this is as important to me as it is to you, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. But um it's a bit of my part. Alright. Carly. Yes, you used to me for I'm going away for a week on Thursday. I don't know, mate. So it's nice I don't that know you hold the call. The fault. <laughs> I'll just quit after you to dehydrate my body and then I'll get stuck in. <laughs> when I go into the shop, I feel a sense of achievement. It looks absolutely beautiful. I love the staff I've got, everything about it I just love. I can't believe me and Carly have actually got our own salon. It's wicked. I'd call it my little paradise. It's taken me about six months to get everything up on my name. 
it's been a real journey. I remember my first day when I was looking for properties. I remember going to London. <laughs> Steeper, what? How much is this one? This is 160 a year. Well, that was dear. There's millions and millions of handbags and shoes. I'm so glad I ended up part of it. Oh, this is brilliant. Oh my God, and you've already got toilet feet in. Male and female, there you go. Oh, I'm so impressed. <laughs> By the time I think it's spectacular. <laughs> I've been on business courses. Beauty courses. Oh, sorry. Just demolished your toenails. Trips. What's goodbye? Gracias. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Fucking hell, look at all these stairs. And have they just set up my own party? I've learned so much. Oh, I don't know. Grace, I think I have. Carly. I am a bit scared about going into business with Jade. It's not always been the best of relationships. We've had to have ups and downs all right. I don't need your help then! I need your help now! The girl never fucking cracks a smile and she knows she's a mood moody. She says it all the time, I know I'm moody. But I couldn't ask for a better partner. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Carly pulled it out of the bag. You know dear, you know dear. We've done everything, sorted the designs, <gasps> no, this is what I want. I want this. I like this. Oh my god! Fantastic. Congratulations. You got the job. Oh, thank you. Congratulations. I finally got a key. An help. Transform a grotty old bank into a beautiful salon. And it's not just been the shop, there's been loads of other stuff going on and all. Ryan, that went peak Tom, didn't you? I've always got my hands full with the boys. And I've still been doing the other work. Yeah, I am seeing more of him now than what I was when I first started filming the show. Oh, the joke. And yeah, I really like it. What's next for Jade Gooding? Ugly's gonna conquer the world! One in London, one in Marbella, one in New York. Perfume, Ugly's perfume, um, Ugly's lingerie, I don't know. Ugly's, 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 Ugly's. It's amazing doing things where I make people feel better about themselves. And also I've made myself feel better about myself because I've got a sense of achievement. So yeah, dreams do come true. to beat the bulge their greatest challenge yet the biggest loser uk thursday at nine new and exclusive to living tv well see the uh, answers to jade's questions at livingtv.co.uk forward slash jade and stay with us derek and meredith are in for a big surprise in a brand new gray's anatomy next